Olivia here. I'm going to talk to you guys today about PLARN. So PLARN just stands for plastic yarn. Um, you can make it out of plastic bags. You'll need a pair of scissors and just a flat surface. What you'll do is you'll take your plastic bag and you'll make it square. So you'll fold in these sides. You'll put it down and flatten it out. But it's nice, no creases, no wrinkles. And then you'll fold it in half so that the handles meet each other. Smooth it out. Then you'll fold it in half again. And again. And then I'm gonna do it one more time. And you'll smooth it out so that it's a nice, thin, long strip. So I'm gonna cut off the very bottom of the bag. Just gonna snip that. I'm gonna cut off the handles. So then I'm gonna measure about two fingers, kinda look, see where that is, and start cutting that width. So I'm just gonna cut up. Okay, now that I have all of these kinda like sushi roll type things, I'm gonna start unraveling them so that I have a loop. This is gonna be your plastic yarn. And I'm gonna keep doing that until all of them are unfolded. I can use three of them and braid them together for a nice bracelet or another project. And once I have enough, I can start to loop them together. If I wanna start weaving with them, you're gonna take two, hold one in your left hand, open it up, hold the other in your right hand, put it through, make a T, and take your right hand into the left hand, and grab, and then they're together. This one in my left hand, this in my right, put it through, make a T, open it up, take my right hand, put it through to my left hand, and then pull up. You'll end up having a very, very long piece, like a yarn ball, and you can weave with this, or what we did here was we made a creature castle, and it is supporting our drawbridge. So you can lower the drawbridge and reveal your creatures. All right, guys, I can't wait to see what you guys make at home with Plarn and how you explore. See you later.